Get ready, guys. Get ready. Begin! Oh, I see it. <laughs> it's like a Viking ship. Do you see it? I like that ship. It's so beautiful. That's a proper battleship. It's got Is a it a battleship? Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a destroyer. It's a Caldari That's destroyer. That's a destroyer. Yeah, Viking. Yeah. Wow. Caldari destroyer. It looks like a submarine, I always thought. It's got a uh, few wingy bits. Just, you know. Yeah. Two on one side, three on the other. I think Dalmont would probably really like this one. Are those oh, all so. turret slots on the top of it? Yes, they and are. And the bottom. And I'm glad you asked because. Got missiles on I'm them. coming back. Yeah, you took off. Where are you going? <laughs> He's turning around. So, suppressed targeting system. What this does is it means that I when can't I target, target Van Helsing. Oh. oh, yeah. He doesn't know I'm targeting him. Really? Yeah. And now what I do is I go. There we go. Don't worry, these won't hurt a bit. I no, see the ball. Oh, man. And here we go. Uh oh. <laughs> what did they do? Oh, I'm passing. Am I missing I you? Oh, no, they're coming back. Oh, man. There we go. They did turn around. Oh, God. <laughs> Snowballs. Being com completely bombarded right now. Being completely engulfed. But people are undocking and there's just snow everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> the guy bumped me. <laughs> Can you imagine how much snow that is? Yeah. That is impressive snow. That is ridiculous amount of snow. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even that. The explosion is like the size of a skyscraper. No. How many of those do you have? No, it's probably like a couple thousand. <laughs> this one's this surprise. <laughs> you asked, so I'll be glad to oblige. I got plenty battle storms on this. So you should see it when I put fireworks in it. Fireworks. Wait, they have those? Yeah, yes, you can do. get fireworks, yeah. I feel like another really fancy Star Trek online. Yay, snowflakes! So the funniest thing is to sit outside Jeta, the trade hub, put the passive targeting system on, and um, just target people as they undock and try to nail them. <laughs> and then they panic, they start panicking, because a lot of them have never seen them before, you know? That's good stuff. Oh my god. So, I'd yeah, be panicking. I, that's why I call it surprise! <laughs> Because suddenly you're just being hit by this massive white explosion, and you're like, what? Imagine a Titan set up that way. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Titan-sized explosion. Well, there, you have to have festival launches, which I think are a medium or a small-sized thing. I thought Titans could hold all sizes. I don't know. Well, well, maybe. I, I, think I mean, can. I'm pretty sh I'm pretty sure if you... I'm actually not sure either. Never tried it is the honest answer. Because they, they specifically say they'll have like small, medium, large, and extra large guns. Oh, this is a limited edition ship as well. May as well get that one extra out. Extra large? I call it Johnny Mnemonic. Because he's a hacker. Have you ever seen a ship with a hacking bonus? They've probably got more of them now, but this is the first one. Where are you guys? Oh, I've seen that. Derpy. Yeah, it is. It's very strange. Yeah, this is the Echelon, which 
She's a hacking, don't lose that ship. Hacking I don't ship. know if you can get it again. I've got two, so I know what you're saying. Oh, well. Yeah, yeah, I Look know. at you. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Spell me good. one, why don't you? I'm a bit of a hoarder when it comes to ships. Put it this don't way, worry. if I lost my account, I'd probably be... Right. See, this is the thing. That's probably why I keep paying for the account, because I've, no, I've got so many ships. There's some strange energy beam on top. Yeah, I don't know what that is. I think it helps with the hacking. Of course it does. <laughs> what else Docking have we got in here? I still haven't found my main ship yet. I just been It'd be nice if there was a mode to put my weapons away. How oh, is chat doing, everyone? Say hello. Chat is doing shroom puns. Ooh, ooh, oh, the suede tie. Ooh, yes, the suede tie. Oh, hang on a minute. Do you want to see the Legion, dude? Sure. Yeah, we'll do the Legion. Oh God, what's the? Oh yeah, it's fine. We'll, we'll do the Legion first. I Ready, set. Tier 3 cruiser, everyone. T3. T3, baby, T3. Three, everyone. Oh god, there's a freaking Ooh. rattlesnake behind me. That's not cool. For the people that asked, this is one of those customizable ships. Yeah, this is one of those customizable ships. Basically, the uh, front foot you see on the nose there, uh, the very back end, the engine, the midsection, or oh, sorry, the little bits that come off the bottom and the midsection are part of four modular pieces um, and each of the pieces gives the ship a different trait so, so pretty much all the floating pieces yeah but they all it changes completely in shape it's not like it just transforms it'll be a completely different shape you know yeah actually you can see that change if you go into like the market and look up t3 cruisers and you preview them every time you preview them it'll change oh, all sorts right. of does it not give you the menu where you can just pick the bits you want anymore i don't know it used to well yeah, so check it out, because like I say, this is this is the configuration that I use. I'm just going to find out what the traits for this one are, because I can't even remember myself. This one is using... Yeah, great. Okay, tell me about it. Uh, right, fitting. This one's using Dissolution Sequencer, which is... 15% to ship sensor strength and 5% to targeting range. Then it's using 10% oh. uh, bonus to armor repair effectiveness. And then it's using 5% bonus to cap recharge. And then it's using. Ah, it's the cloaky one. So. 100% bonus to medium turret energy capacitor use, and also 100% reduction in cloaking device use. So, can fit cover ops cloaks. So, in other words, you use this for, you know, warping when cloaked, basically. So you can go in null sec and no one will see you. Uh, and then the last one was 5% bonus to max velocity, because I had, like, this crazy expensive afterburner. So with that, I could make it faster than the other T3, which is supposed to be the fastest one. But anyway, that's why I did that. So that's what I got. The Legion. Pretty cool ship. But yeah, I've got one more ship to show you guys, because I've just realized that the inspiration, Talking my inspiration for my solar sailor... Just exploded? No, no, it's it's actually in this hangar. Oh. And this is mm. another limited edition ship that you can't buy. <laughs> I'll find a way. Yeah, you can buy them on the contracts. It's called I know a, exactly what you're talking about. Yep, it's called a Zephyr. Yep, there it is. 
And as you can see... <laughs> it's like a pod racer. Yeah, it is like a pod racer. Look at that beauty. Oh, you know... Oh. What's the ring on the back? Dunno, but it spins. I guess it helps with the solar wind. That's the way it shines. They've kind of changed it. The front sail isn't as shiny anymore, but it's got more of a material to it, so it's cool. It shines it on looks the inside, like... which makes more sense. <laughs> but the coolest thing about this ship... Oh, whoa, 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 look at that. That's new. What is that? What? That it's thing. It's on the front cover. A bar guest. Bargus. It's a Galen oh, yeah, battleship. That, that's a new battleship. Wow, man. It won't let me look at it. Yeah, no, it didn't let me look at that it. That was awesome. Yeah, there's a new faction with three new ships. <coughs> really? That are, they're all <coughs> very flat. What's the name of the faction? Mordu's Legion. Oh, Docking they're the dust people. What? Here, I'll link the ships for you. Mordu's Legion were the people that were the first dust mercenaries. Right, time to get the suede tie then. There you go. Linked it. The, uh, the frigate and the battleship look amazing. I'm not so sure about the... This is okay. Where did you link it? The chat. I don't see it. Oh. Kaldari Frigate. That is a cool... Crossage links. That is a cool frigate, dude. Crossage links. You should absolutely watch Doctor Who. It's great. Doctor Who's great. It is actually good. Right. And then the next season looks even better. Yeah. Ooh. Just battleship. Ooh, and a sign such a battleship flying out as well. Eve. Uh, yep, Sansa night nightmare. That thing's crazy. It is a nightmare. It takes a magical. So, and then there's a Kaldari cruiser. And I don't know if you know, but like they've like some of the ships that they've remodeled have like warp animations, so like wings will fold in and stuff. Oh wow, I didn't know that. Like on the, the cruiser. The cruiser, those like two things that are sticking out to the side, they like like rotate and stuff when that goes to warp. Wow, this thing's epic. Yeah, it's crazy. Very sleek. That looks like special ops. I don't know, you guys are talking about loads of stuff, so I don't know what question was asked, guys. He asked if you were a part of his pink army. I don't know. <laughs> it's best not to answer. I don't know what don't that means. <laughs> so, right. Uh, so, yeah. Belts. What Belts. security state is 0.5? Excellent, right. I'm gonna warp us. One of the coolest looking ships. I love this ship. I will be building that someday. My favorite ship in this is the Titan or the Amar starter ship. I don't know why. Or Titans though. Which one do you like the most? Hello, Yelby. Uh, are you in the same system? 
Yeah. Lima. No, Venlin. Okay. It's in the uh, thingy. Oh. <laughs> Destination. What? Is that well, thanks, not man, awesome? But... It's in the <laughs> chat. It's in the chat. Look at it. My map just told me you were in this system. So. Oh, random. Got map. Oh, that's because it doesn't update often. That's why. Five minutes. And yes, I will eventually be making Eve ships in Star Maid, but right now I'm focusing on station contest. Yeah, everyone is. Look at the negative and... space. Nice use of wedging. Oh yeah, that'll be fun. Tom, if I had like first person control of this, I'll be flying in between those uh pods off to your side. <laughs> yeah. The station looks awesome now as well. Everything just looks better. You know? I wonder if we could dock to that station and put my uh, rockets on. You've seen this one, haven't you, Chris? The Oracle. I have. I've checked out a lot of the ships. Right, I'm gonna uh, go dock the, up then. I've, I've done that through the previewer. Ah, uh, but have you actually... Well, yeah, I suppose actually that's in a way better. I have not flown a lot of them, though. <laughs> What have I flown? Let me think. I think I've flown most of them now. Let me look at ISIS. Requested. Let's go and swap that ship out Talking and get the next one. Accepted. I've had a Merlin, a Heron, uh... I don't know if I've had a Condor. I've had a Kestrel. Cormorant. Got my Naga. Heracle. Yay, battleships. Are you gonna get in a battleship? Yep. Bring in the battle, but bring in the uh, uh, Abaddon out. That looks huge. Mm hmm. Ooh, a uh, an Abaddon? Or... <laughs> yeah, an Abaddon. Abaddon, yeah. An Abaddon. <laughs> I'm coming, Yelby. Although I've got Please nothing fitted me. at the moment, so there's no guns on it or anything, it's just by the looks of it. Let's have a look at the fitting panel. <laughs> Let's bring that to um. It's empty. <laughs> it's just rigged. Aw. Yeah, there's no guns it, on it. How it looks big like is it's that? supposed to like split into pieces. So, uh, Yelby, have you like, since you're on a temp account, you have not seen a lot of these ships. I've been on Eve in probably three years. Yeah, a lot of my cool stuff isn't here. It's up at Uhu la 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 No, no, la 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 you la 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 Oh, that must suck horribly. Nah, because usually the only way you could get one is by having like your own space and a station and all this. So, Dark. what's this? Can you make custom ships or only pre-made ships? You've got modular ships, so you can sort of customize it to look like you want. But it's not cosmetic; it's functional, and anyone could make that combo. But there are ones for each of the four races. Playable races. Just to yep. answer you there, Sausage Links. He was asking if you can make them uh, make custom. Inc ships. They're incredibly hard to get to because yeah. they're tier three. Yeah, I've, which is I've, the highest tier. Yeah, I, I couldn't help myself. I had to have <laughs> one. So I have a Legion. You need to undock. <laughs> I'm trying to warp you and you can't. I'm Warped undocking. Ah, oh, okay. I'm just bringing out the mushroom ship to show everyone. Look at that. But, to add to that, Sausage Links, um, they may be releasing, like, customizable paint jobs. I'm not entirely sure how much they're willing to go into that, but they do have, like, variant paint jobs that you can buy. And it's basically Tom. the same ship, but it has a different look. Tom, I can't lock onto you. Mm. Look at that paint job, man. They've really outdone themselves with this new update. 
Oh, that's the mushroom ship. Yeah. Uh -huh. The Armageddon. Do -do. We used to run Armageddon level Aussie 5 Dark. missions with uh, in a gang with a bunch of these. I don't think I've done any missions. I get oh, in, that's what I we get ever in, used to do. I get involved in one of the biggest corporations right now, and I have hardly done anything with them. It's probably... Yeah, that's the, that's the trouble with... Yeah, I know. Oh, there you are. Docking again. I'll take you on. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> oh, there's somebody in a Tengu. Yeah, there's a Tengu coming out of the dock. Where Look at he? him real quick. There he is. I oh, know, that's no, that's you. Where is he? Where is he? Did he leave? No, he's still here. It's Amp Omic. Docking. Nah, he's gone. Requested. Yeah, he's gone. <laughs> Hello, Kamikaze. Welcome to the stream. Oh, whoa. Talking I don't think I've seen this station before. Wait, hey, this is this is my home. Wow. This is my true home. It's a good home. Look, I got an Ibis, a stolen <laughs> Ibis, <laughs> Ibis, two Imperas, a Caldari shuttle, and 31 Galent shuttles. <laughs> Let's get back in my uh, frigate. Right, new destination. Destination. Get my assets. How far is it to my home? Eight jumps. That's where all my stuff is. God, it's here. Let's go. Don't think about it. Just go. There's no time to lose. Where are we going? the hell? Oh, there you go. There. Follow me, space friends. Warp drive active. First jump. Let, Kino. That's, that's tier two, right? What's that? Warship that you're in right now. Yes. I will show you the fitting. Da -da 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 -da. It has four tier two rocket launchers, a tier two one mega newton micro warp drive, a tier two cap recharger, a target painter for all my missile bros in fleet, a uh, small armor repairer two, damage control two, ballistics control two, and power two, power diagnostic system two. Next jump is the Renta. Warp drive active. Um, and then I've got an anti-thermic pump for the little hole that it has in the armor there. And then a little capacitor to, you know. But to be <laughs> honest, it's a bit of a lol fit because there's better fits that you could have. But for what I use it for, which is basically a shuttle. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? It doesn't, really, yeah. it doesn't really matter. And then in that hole I keep more inferno rockets like 12,000 <laughs> it's ridiculous and some nanite repair also a certificate on hull tanking which I'm going to put in my in my stash next jump is Uemis Sison but yeah it, it's, it's alright it's a cool little ship you know I like it I never used to like the T1 version of it, by the way. Who likes any T1 version? Yeah, it's, it's one of those things, you know. Cannon fodder. Yeah, they just get popped. Like even the cruisers, man. I think it's because with T2, you get such better resists that you don't need to put those modules in. So... You know. Oh, to answer the question from Sausage Links Bravo in chat, defiance? No. No, I did not. What is defiance? It was a tie-in with the sci-fi show. That's what I thought. Heard about it. 
Yeah, it was one of the. It was. It was. It was a cool idea. <laughs> but it didn't work out, did it? No. I didn't think so. Did the game actually like end? I don't think so. I think they're still going. Because I've not heard anything. Hey, about hey! The TV if they show. get renewed for a season two, then it'll be awesome. Do you know what I mean? You, there's no getting away from that. Yeah, it is a cool concept to tie in a show with a game. It's just how do you actually pull it off, you know? Yeah. Because uh, Hawking was supposed to have a show tie in with their game, but it never really happened. But they just did like a promo movie. You know what I mean? Nice. You can find it on YouTube. It's pretty cool. But uh, Hawking was fun. Yeah, it was fun. I was in on the uh, first, first closed. No. Was it a closed beta? I think it, I don't know. January about a year ago. Next jump yeah. is Elenia. You guys are a jump ahead of me. Mm. Where are you going? I am I'm heading the to the, the old faction, my old faction hate headquarters. I think they've moved it. Kadari Navy Logistics Support. They've moved it, but all my stuff's still there. So, oh, warp through the planet. I love it when that happens. You get like a little tunnel. You'll get it on your jump to Elenia. That was sweet. Ask more questions, chat. Yeah, ask more questions, chat. We love it. Feed us content. Content, content. I'm just generally hypnotized by the art, this game, the backdrops, there's <laughs> damn. I love, Kaldari gates are like the best gates in this game. What I like is the fact that all the planets are like, there's actually a system behind, you know, you don't just have like random or a lava one and a barren one. It depends how far they are from the star, you know? As far as real life goes, why good. can't our solar system have a cool backdrop like the Eve does? <laughs> like, that would be so nice. Totally realistic is, is. Tom, how often do you run into players that want to fight you? Well, to be honest, that time just earlier was the first time ever, and I just said no. Um, see, usually, like, my, the way I play this game is I set up planets, and I have my clones mine planetary interaction for me and I have them run that over the border which means I've got to run all three characters across a nullsec border to deliver materials to my tier 3 production planet and then Tamino Sama sells all the stuff right? Usually enriched uranium but the point is that my game is sneaking past border camps because there'll be like 8 ships sat on a gate and I'll have to sneak past them. So it's like, they don't really get to fight me. <laughs> they either catch me or they don't. Because I'm not really defending myself. You know, I'm just trying to get away. But it's it's awesome. Because you can make so oh much God. money. The chat on my, my, my other monitor just like split in half. So like half the text moved up the screen. Uh. What? He just said, really, is, is again. Oh, there we go. But no, seriously, um, it's, it's an interesting way to make money in the game, because it's just passive. All you have to do is fly to the planet and pick up the stuff, pretty much. Uh, but I, you, I, you have to come up with your own system for it as well, which is pretty cool. Keeps you busy. Last jump. Ooh, hoo lining. You don't really have to worry about getting in fights unless you're in a more targeted corporation, you know? Yep. If you're, ac if you're actively in a war, then you have to, you know, kind of be wary. Especially in null sec or low sec. <laughs> look, look, sausage. Why is why? What is what? Sausage, get off the Y holes, man. <laughs> Tom, do you think there's anyone out there on EVE who would use a Titan? to mine ore. No. 
A Titan to mine, no, but there is a guy that mines in a Dreadnought, and it's called the Veldnaught. You can look it up online. <laughs> it's V-E-L-D, Nought. That, that is great. <laughs> yeah. He, it, it was because when they locked down the systems, there was one capital court in Empire, and he can't leave. So he just put a mining laser on it and started mining. <laughs> okay. In your system, also. I am finally here. The uh, nebula in the background is like one of my favorites. So what have I actually got here? Oh my god. Um. All right. Let's just use the inventory because I think it'll be more robust. Item hanger. I've got a women's T-shirt. That'll come in handy. <laughs> is everything just been put into one horrible massive yeah there's like a thousand items in here let's just go to shit it looks crazy okay so oh i've got a gnosis i never even knew i had one of these i gotta fly this like right now oh wow has it got anything on it it's got nothing on it at all. Right, I'm flying it outside. I'm coming now. I'm coming. What is this? Wow. It's one of those um, fifth race ships. It's a cruiser, man. Shelby, did you dock? I'm still warping. I'm the Van slowest ship in the room. I'm coming to you, <laughs> man. Look at this. Outside. You have a Gnosis? I have a Gnosis. Get out of here. Look at this. Oh, I'm behind you. you. You be right. Okay, dock and then undock, and you'll be where I am, basically. I'm just gonna park up below the grid. Yeah. Oh. oh. <laughs> that is a ship that I look forward to making. That's crazy. I think it was limited edition. I have no idea how I have it. Yeah. Probably it because be. my account was active. <laughs> I'm just gonna stop the uh, ship. Oh, there you are. Oh my. Approach. Oh, that thrasher is a war target. <laughs> really? It's okay. I think we're in a high sec system. Well, if you're a war target, does it matter? I don't know, but if they lock me, I'll just dock out. I mean, no, they took off. Look at that. I'm gonna bump you. Sorry. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> My perfect screenshot. <laughs> it's all good. Oh, there you are. Oh no! I think we've made the screenshot better. Is it actually located between two Milky Way arms? Because I thought we were in an arm. What? Our solar system. No idea. Kamikaze just talked. Oh. Why we don't have cool backdrops like... Oh, oh, he's saying why in real life does we not have a solar system? Yeah. Right, 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 right. We don't have those awesome backdrops. I would oh, say no. it's because humans love colour and we will we'll just we'll just put colour where there isn't. Well This thing looks got... like some kind of World War Two seaplane without wings and like crazy pipey bits. They need to complete the uh the Jove stuff. Like, that's just sitting there. Also, it's got like a little, um, like, watchtower on top. Oh, yeah. I wonder if that's where you're piloting from. Yeah, that's where the pod plugs in. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a world eater, but except someone that scrunched the backup. Yeah, it does look a bit like the world eater. Right. Let's dock this thing up and see what else I got, because this is my main place. I got so many ships here, it's untrue. Oh. <laughs> Yelby's stuck on Docking the other side of the station. Oh, is he? <laughs> yeah. I docked oh, up. Oh, what? Has he not seen this thing yet? Damn. Did you see it on the stream, Yelby? Because I'll come back out if you missed it, mate. This is like... Yeah, I saw it. Ah, you saw it. Cool, cool, cool. I'm moving in. 
Oh. So what else do I have? I've got oh my God. a curse. I've got oh, I've got an Ashimu. These are quite rare. I'm gonna get directly in your path of travel for when you. Here you go. These are evil as well. We used to use them in a pair. See him? Ooh. Ooh, yeah. They're um, what's the info? Uh, info. They are Blood Raiders. Right. Minmatar Amar technology. It looks like one of those things you get in a Super Smash Brothers Brawl. Mm -hmm. Type the instant KO thing. Hmm. Blood Raiders, so it's all splattered with blood. And this thing has, is this thing evil? If you uh, just check out the bonuses on this thing. Traits, look at this. 100% bonus to medium energy turret. 15 <laughs> nice stopping action. Yeah, 15% bonus to vampire and 20% bonus to web of fire. Also applies to neutralizers for the thing. So yeah, nice. Oh weird, I didn't know you actually bumped me. Sorry, did I bump you into the... <laughs> no, I'm not that far. Uh -huh. Alright, dock it up, next ship. Docking permission requested. Docking request <laughs> People are trying to undock and we're just parked on the grid, it's funny. <laughs> what else we got here? That guy's in a coloration. Oh, what's that? An Algos? What the heck's that? Do I even have the skills thing? to fly it? I don't know. I've got oh. skills to fly. Oh, it's one of those destroyers. Assemble ship. Uh. Make active. And undock. Wow. I did not know that. What? Because uh, every time I've looked at, like, sentry guns and stuff, I didn't know you had to actually mount the guns on them. I thought oh, that mate. they were this a part cool. of it. Look at this. Oh mate, it's got little look, it's got little hangers. Right. Stop. Didn't someone make this in Star Made? Yes Pro they did. Probably. But I think they made it like three times as big as it was supposed to be. Look at and that. They, they they made it like a civilian ship. Actually I remember flying through those hangers. Yeah, I, I somebody definitely did make it and they made it all white. Let me get the uh mm -hmm. Look at it, it's amazing. No oh, info. It's 239 meters long. Not that big. So, what's supposed to be inside of those pods? In Radar. the pods? No, no, I actually know what's inside those oh, pods. Oh, really? What, 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 what? They're, they're the uh, communications equipment for the drones. Oh, because they're drone, they're a drone specialized race, aren't they? These guys. Yep. They're, they're, this is like one of the only ships that has a cross-section picture available. Oh. Yeah, because not like none of them have oh, like look. official. There's a salvager guy. Oh, off he oh, goes. Just... Whoa, that warp. Oh, okay. That was cool. Yeah, that's a new effect. That was cool. And they have a new warp in effect too, and it looks like um, like when you warp in, it kind of like does this little flash. Oh, nice. And you probably Star can't. Trek. You probably can't hear it, but it like does a little boom too. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. That was amazing when they. It made, does come in a little bit. Right. I love that ship though. Looks so good. I'm gonna show everyone. Right. right. I'm gonna Star tell Trek. you. Yeah. Uh, this ship I'm just about to bring out. This was my ship. When I first started playing for like the first year, this is all I was flying. Like, because that's all I had the skills for. I was grinding up, leveling and stuff. This is it. This was what I was flying. The lowly omen. Oh, so it's that... a shuttle pod. Is that a command ship? No, it's... My tier 2 version is a heavy assault. 
But this is just a cruiser, T1 cruiser. Nothing. So I'm your ship is going to annoy me. Why? It is asymmetrical. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, it's one of those. But I just wanted None to show you that one perfect. quick, because... Ooh, look at the one behind us, it's a... Uh... It's weird, you come to, you come to, you come to really like the shape of something when you've been forced to look at it for a long time. There's a Noctis heading for you. <laughs> yeah, well, I see him. I'm turned. Around. That's a big ship. He'll probably turn and walk. Most people are too impatient to get that far. Like, if you go a few seconds and stop, unless it's a battleship, you know, most people will turn and walk off. Too impatient. Noctis is 859. Oh, what's this? I've got something called surprise. Surprise. Yeah. Surprise. Oh, no way. It's. Oh yes, guys, get ready. What? Oh man. Welcome back. I am on Eve Online. This is Channel B, and I'm with Chris the Nightbringer. Yelby's patching, and. Uh... I am in Caputenon. Look at this station. Ooh. What is it? Control F9. Yeah. I was I forgot because I always used to do it by accident recording with uh, France. Have, have you seen any of my vi e videos? No. I think I've seen the one. I got. To do with got some pretty rate. nice shots. Yeah, you do. Got some pretty nice shots of some fleet action. Oh yeah. Oh god, yeah. Full 255 fleets, and they're all they're all noobs and frigates. It's the best thing. Uh, nice. All right, fun docking. Okay, first jump in the route. Let's go. Warp drive active. I want I to see your warp drive, son. Wow, the station had just came up crazy big. I don't really see a lot of going to station. Jump, jump, jump! Don't want to miss that jump animation. That was FTL, ladies and gentlemen. Three jumps out. I love the Kaldara gates, they're so good. Dem solar flares. I don't even think I've seen a Galante gate. No. no, I never had until just then, and then the police tried to kill me, so uh, <laughs> yeah, probably the last time I'll see one too. I usually try to route around it, but it's because I was coming to meet you and you were already there, you know? Ready, rockets! Oh, rockets! Ready, aim, rockets! <laughs> 